Hi, my name is Lucy Maglia with Grow Socially, and today we're going to give you some tips on how to get started on LinkedIn. Step one, LinkedIn.com, you got to sign up, uh, give them a professional email address, a school university email address or a work email uh, works best, um, and then some login information that you can remember. Step one, you're on LinkedIn. Step two, you got to add your information. Relevant job experience education experience, um, anything that you think a potential employer would really want to know. A uh, informed biography that you can write in there, you can get testimonials and recommendations from uh, past employees or uh, supervisors. So that's important stuff too. All things that you would want any prospective uh, clients or future potential employers to want to know. All things you want to get on LinkedIn. That's the point of LinkedIn. It's not like Facebook or anything else where it's more for social networking and for uh, you know more recreational purposes. LinkedIn is really strictly about the job market um, so this is a great vehicle for you to get your name out there and to potentially get some new jobs. Step three, this is an important one, upload your resume. So now anyone that views your profile can see your resume and all your body of work, all the work experience you've had and uh, as you would know I assume a resume really is your way to get all of your information out there and if it's right here on LinkedIn on your profile everyone can see it. This seems like some simple stuff but LinkedIn really is used uh, not properly by a lot of people um, and that really is a shame because LinkedIn is a really powerful tool even some people in the office we found through LinkedIn so it can happen there's definitely some practical um, applications for LinkedIn and there's some good examples of how it has worked for people. Step four, you make connections. This is an important one too because this is how you meet new people. Um, go out, find, you have, there are lists of connections you can meet of people you've worked with or people um, that people you've worked with have worked with. And these are great ways to make connections. Also, on LinkedIn you can join groups, um, similar industry groups or interest groups um, whether it be with your major if you're still in college or something you've still done um, in the workforce, all things that you can work with. For myself, I'm in some social media marketing groups on LinkedIn. It's a great way to make new connections. It's also a great way to learn some things about the industry you're in. Um, so that's really it. Four easy steps to get started on LinkedIn. Uh, sign up today and get noticed by some of the people out there. Make some new connections. All right, thanks for watching.